Hi, good morning. We're going to read one last Eric Carle book today. It's Roosters Off to See the World by Eric Carle. So here's the front cover. Here's the back cover. And this is one of those cool books where if you open it all the way up, you get a whole big picture. Look at that rooster with his pretty tail. And I picked this book because it's an Eric Carle book, which we're studying um, this week. And then it's a counting book because we're studying numbers next week. So I thought it was a good Saturday book. So we'll look at the end pages because we remember Eric Carle always puts interesting art on the pages of his book at the end and the front and the, and the end. And then here's our title page. Roosters Off to See the World by... Eric Carl. That's right. All right, here we go. One fine morning, a rooster decided that he wanted to travel. So right then and there, he set out to see the world. He had not walked very far when he began to feel lonely. Look, here's who's traveling. Eric Carl put this in the corner of each page so we know who's traveling. So right now, just rooster is off to see the world. But maybe he'll find some friends along the way. Just then he met two cats. The rooster said to them, come along with me to see the world. And the cats liked the idea of a trip very much. We'd love to, they purred. And they set off down the road with the rooster. So we have two cats, one, two. We add that to the rooster and now we have one, two, three, three animals traveling together. As they wandered on, the rooster and the cats met three frogs. How would you like to come with us to see the world? Asked the rooster. He was eager for more company. Why not, answered the frogs. We're not busy now. So the frogs jumped along behind the rooster and the cats. So let's see, we have three frogs. One, two, three. And we already had one rooster, two cats. And now three frogs. So how many are traveling all together? Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six animals all together. After a while, the rooster, the cats, and the frogs saw four turtles crawling slowly down the road. Hey, said the rooster, how would you like to see the world? It might be fun, snapped one of the turtles and they joined the others. All right, so we have four turtles. One, two, three, four. And they're traveling together. So we had one rooster, two cats, three frogs, four turtles. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Ten animals traveling together. As the rooster, the cats, the frogs, and the turtles walked along, they came upon five fish swimming in the brook. Where are you going? asked the fish. We're off to see the world, answered the rooster. May we come along? pleaded the fish. I'm delighted to have you, the rooster replied. And so the fish came along to see the world. So five fish. One, two, three, four, five. Let's look at our chart. One rooster, two cats three frogs, four turtles, five fish. Let's see. We had 10 animals traveling and now we've added five more. Does anybody know what that is? 10 plus five. Let's count and find out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. 15 animals traveling together. That's so many. The sun went down and it began to get dark. The moon came up over the horizon. Where's our dinner? Asked the cats. Where are we supposed to sleep? Asked the frogs. We're cold, complained the turtles. Just then some fireflies flew overhead. We're afraid, cried the fish. Now the rooster really had not made any plans for the trip around the world. He had not remembered to think about food and shelter, so he did not know how to answer his friends. Hmm, I wonder what they will do. After a few minutes of silence, the five fish decided that it might be best if 
They headed for home and they wished the others a happy trip and they swam away. So the five fish, one, two, three, four, five, swam away. So we had 15 animals traveling together and then five of them left. So 15, take away five. Let's see how many that is. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Fifteen, take away five, is ten. So he still has ten animals on his trip. So let's see. Then the turtles, they began to think about their warm house. And they turned and crawled back down the road without so much as saying goodbye. So the four turtles are leaving. One, two, three, four. So we had 10 animals and now four of them are leaving. So that's 10, take away four. One, two, three, four, five, six. Just six animals traveling together now. Here they all are. The frogs weren't very happy with the trip either. First one, then the other. And finally, the last one jumped away. They were polite enough though, to wish the rooster a good evening as they disappeared into the night. So here's our three frogs, they're leaving too. One, two, three. So we had six animals traveling together and three of them left. So how many are left? Six take away three is three. Half of the animals are gone now. Just three, one rooster plus two cats is three. All right, here they are, the rooster and his two cat friends. Let's see what they decide to do. The cats remembered an unfinished meal they had left behind and kindly wished the rooster a happy journey and then they too headed for home. One, two. Now the rooster was all alone and he hadn't seen anything of the world. He thought for a minute and then said to the moon, to tell you the truth, I'm not only hungry and cold, but I'm homesick as well. The moon did not answer, it had disappeared. So who's left after the two cats left? There were three and then two left. So what's left? One, just rooster. Here he is and the moon is gone too. Well, it's leaving. <sighs> the rooster knew what he had to do. He turned around and went back home again. He enjoyed a good meal of grain and then he sat on his very own perch and after a while he went to sleep and he had a wonderful happy dream all about a trip around the world. Look, there he is sleeping. <clears throat> the end. Did you guys like roosters off to see the world? I hope so. All right, I love you, I miss you and I wish you well, bye.